Who are you? Who are you? I'm asking you because you're recording people without their consent. I'm recording you guys. Can we get your name, please? Sure. Right there on your camera, take it. Nah, sometimes my viewers can't read. You gotta pronounce it's your policy. No, it's not. Yeah, it is your policy. No, uh, what makes you say that? What's your name, sir? You need something? Yeah, I need, your, I need her name and your name, too. Well, why? why? I need your name because you guys are public servants and you guys are running from the camera. You, you? you the just problem? pulled your friend to the back. Okay, that's, that's so fine. So why'd you do that? Because I had to. That's where we're at, America. In Miami, Florida. Okay, folks, I just would like to say something before I start this video. I did not have any plans to stop at this post office. It was a Friday afternoon and I was on my way home. And I didn't want to be late to a dinner I was supposed to attend. I was kind of in a rush. Maybe I should have waited when I had more time or not. I don't know. But something told me to stop by here anyways. I kind of found this audit a little unfinished. I'm not sure. Correct me if I'm wrong. Let me know what you think in the comments in the end of this video. But regardless of the fact, this will get a revisit real soon. And I also would love to expose this first part of this visit of the horrible behavior that we have with these government employees and the rudeness that you're about to witness in this video. We'll see you on the end and enjoy the video. Okay, folks, I turned my camera to the side there just for a few seconds. Stay tuned. I turn it. Reason why is because there are little kids right there. They're toddlers, and you know I'm not about that life. So just stay tuned. It's about to get pretty crazy. What was that? Who are you? Who are you? I'm asking you because you're recording people without their consent. I'm recording you guys and I didn't point the Why? camera at the kids. Why? Because I can I can record. I just want some service and that's it. Alright, Uh, I just need a stamp, and and I need her name too, and the one that ran back there too. Yeah. How many? Is him? How yeah. many stamps do you need? I just need one stamp. Can I get your name too, please? Are you the supervisor? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I need both their names. Yeah. Well, actually, they don't have to do anything to, for me to get their names. I just want to know who's working in this shift. That's okay, it. you don't have to have an attitude. I'm no, I don't have an attitude. Absolutely yeah, you do. don't. No, I don't. You actually do. No, I, I keep going. I'm are you wondering why I'm filming, ma'am? Huh? Are you wondering why I'm filming? Oh, no, I really don't care. I can tell you. I'm not talking to you. No. I can tell you why I'm filming. I don't care. You guys, are, you guys are government employees. I just came to get a stamp. Okay. And she so ran back there to get you because I'm recording. Yeah, you can pay for your stamp. And I, right yeah, and I need to know. I need their names too. 
bubblegum popping supervisor while she's out dealing with the public. I did not realize this while I was recording, but I did catch it after I saw this video. Very professional. What do you guys think? Yeah, Yeah. All right. Thank you. Okay. Can I get her name, please? Can we get your name, please? Sure. Right there on your camera. Take it. Nah. It's sometimes my viewers can't read. You gotta pronounce. It's your policy. No, it's not. Yeah, it is your policy. No, it's not. Uh, what makes you say that? It's not. You guys are you guys are public servants. Okay. You know that, right? And it's your policy to identify. Yeah. Oh. Huh? Where's uh, where's that? You don't gotta be rude. This is why I come and record you guys. Not I'm not harassing nobody. I'm not harassing. I didn't like the way you came at me there. I just need your name and I'll be on my way. Don't say anything. So ignore, your, then ignore the public. Is that what you get paid for? We don't pay you for that. I didn't come rude to you at all. How you doing, man? Would you mind identifying yourself? No, why not? You still want, you're another one who wants to violate policies? Excuse me? You're another one who wants to violate policies? What's the point of this? No, uh, to see if you're professional or not. I am professional. No, then, and then let me get your name. You know, it's your policy to identify to the public. You guys, you guys are unprofessional. You can't do that. Just because I have a camera, what if I didn't? Would you still, would you still give me your name? You've been, you had, you got service. Yeah, I know, I understand I got service. I understand that. What you need, sir? You need something? Yeah, I need your, I need her name and your name too. But why? why? I need your name because you guys are public servants and you guys are running from the camera. You can't okay, do well, that. Okay, what's the problem? You what, you, do, what do you need? I just come to get service real quick, okay. and I want to know you guys' names and you guys are running from the camera. You but can't what do, do you that. Need a, the names for what? Because happened? it's your policy, and I want to know who I, I who's working this shift right now. All of everybody. Okay. Because you guys are running from the camera. But nobody's running from the camera. Yeah, right you are. Here. You're back there. What's you just the pulled your friend to the back. Who is your? You, you're here talking you, to you. What's you the just problem? pulled your friend to the back. Okay, that's that's so fine. So why'd you do that? Because I had to. I was conversating I with her. This up here. That's okay, why so I why did you pull her to the back? Because I control this. That's no, why. Okay, so you control her? Yeah, I do. Yeah, you control her. Yeah. I was in the middle of a conversation with her, and you pulled her to the back. Okay, well, now I want your name. What do you need? I want your name. What happened? I want your name because you're being rude. My name Jackie. is Jackie. What's the name? Jackie Jackie. Yeah? You, you don't need to uh, keep on. This, yeah. this What's the problem? Yo, I just, I just want their names and that's it. I told you Jackie. Jackie, Jackie? all right, cool. Thank you. All that's right. all I need. You're not going to give me your name? Okay. I'm not bothering nobody. Yo, I'm not bothering. I'm not bothering nobody, dude. I come here to get service, and she immediately went, went, she went rude on me. Her, yeah. And they ran to the back. She pulled her friend. This is, nah, nah. I was, I just need their names. That, that's crazy. I'm not harassing nobody. As soon as I walked in here, and I told her. And she ran to the back and got her supervisor. Yeah. Okay. And she didn't want to identify. She didn't want to identify. You guys are unprofessional, all of you. At least you identified, but your attitude sucks. No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. I don't come here for that. I don't come here for this. You have a good day, too. Now I'm going to sit here and record to you guys close. Nah, yeah. Say hi to, say hi to all the platforms. Now I'm going to sit here and record all of you guys. Say hi. There you go, guys.
que ver. Too bad. People are rude as hell. Yeah. What's new in post offices, guys? The freak shows. This is what you got. Say hi, mom. Straight up. Came a little late, but they were extremely rude here. Now, I definitely have some unfinished business here, ladies and gentlemen. And I apologize once again, but I really had to go. And it was also their closing time. But that still does not give them the reason or the right to treat me the way they did. What's this? I said Friday. Yes, this upcoming week real soon. Stay tuned for the next visit. This is the post office on Kendall Drive in 100 and. I think it's 109th Avenue in Miami, Florida. Snapper Creek Branch, Miami, Florida, guys. They are just about to close, so um, this is a for sure a, other a revisit that I will be doing. And what do you think about that behavior? Rest in peace, Jay.